Well, health officials are reporting those two victims in Oklahoma County, a man in his 70s and a man in his 40s. Now, health officials say those positive cases are expected to go up once test results keep coming back. We anticipated we would probably have a rise in numbers, and that's uh, less a function of the infection rate increasing and more of our testing uh, actual testing results coming back and catching up. The Oklahoma Secretary of Health, Jerome Lothridge, reacting to the latest numbers reported by the State Department of Health. 164 positive cases reported. Five Oklahomans have died, including two men in Oklahoma County, a man in his 70s, and the youngest victim to die from the disease in the state, a man in his 40s. The reason that we need to prevent um, infection in that age group is that they are very likely to be in contact with older folks yeah. and folks who are otherwise ill. Lothridge says the aggressive policy decisions Governor Stitt announced yesterday to close all non-essential businesses is aimed at flattening the curve to further slow down the growth of the virus. Allowing testing to catch up and allowing our first responders in the med medical community uh, to preserve vital PPE. Patrina Adger, KOCO 5 News.